And actually reading the script, I wasn't aware how special the world was going to be. It's got all the elements of fantastic post-apocalyptic film, which is where's the world going, what's happening, where are we heading, you know, which is terrifying. Family has to stick together to survive out here, especially with the Citadel raising the price of seeds. The world that they've created for us to inhabit, it's fascinating, it's very um, multifaceted, very complex. It's really thought through to a high level. I was blown away, honestly, by the attention to detail. They have created a universe, and the moment you walk in, you want to look at everything. She likes you. With her garden, Vesper creates a bit of light and beauty in this horrible world. She changes these disgusting, ugly plants into beautiful flowers. I've never seen anything like it. I saw the reference photos and I thought, oh, this, this looks amazing. This is, but this is probably just going to be a rough idea, though. Then I came in, literally saw the reference photo on the table, looked up, and it was exactly the same thing. It's, it's a very easy film to act in, to sit in and, 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 in, and inhabit, because it's so real. But things have been a bit tense here. A few days ago, a germinating seed disappeared. You could sense that from the script, from reading the script, because obviously it's written that way. But when you read something and then you see it, sometimes you can be disappointed. And that hasn't been the case at all with this. You know, I've got here, I thought, wow, that's brilliant. The whole thing is about a great idea. And to, and to express that idea with complexity and nuance, which is fascinating.